What's going on, everybody? Brandon the Big Swerve Anderson, and to my right, Ray Barry the Dean, or as I like to call him, the Barracuda. So it's gotcha. we, a good thing. It's a good one. So anyway, we get a lot of calls about, hey, how do you charge? I would like a quote. I have X amount of boxes or whatever like that. Two things in the industry. Number one, some people will charge by the pound. Okay, Shred America, we charge by the large rolling bin. We'll come up there, we dump, we dump the documents directly into the bin, and, and then... Jam, and jam pack it. So another, another, one thing to look for if someone is charging you by the pound is nine. I 90% mean, of shredded companies don't have a scale on the truck. So they're estimating your weight. And these, these containers empty are 50 pounds. So are they backing out the weight of the container? Probably not. So... You want to try to stay away from per pound. That's the way uh, the industry was 20, 25 years ago. Continue, Brandon. Yep. And what a lot of people is, they are not as familiar with their documents as they think. You know, so maybe they have, they're in garbage bags in their garage, or maybe they have boxes that aren't completely full. So we want, we want to not charge by the box, like I said, because it's not completely really full. We want to fill this guy up. And that way you have a very transparent way of knowing you get your best bang for the buck. Yeah, because companies that charge by the box, which is sometimes good for budgeting, but like what Brandon just said, is you're going to get charged for a full box, whether it's full or not. That's correct. So with That's this, right. like we did in a previous video, mm -hmm. I think you can get about six or seven of these in this bin. That's so, right. And we jam pack it. So you're getting the most bang for your buck in these. All so, day, every day. One thing I wanted to mention, though, yeah. if you are you know cleaning up around the house and doing some spring cleaning, summer cleaning, all that stuff, clean out the garage, and you've got maybe three of these boxes or less, definitely get on the Shred America website, shredamerica.com. Check out our uh, our drop and, and ship, our drop and shred locations. Drop and shred locations, which are national, which is on our website. Because um, if you don't have at least probably seven to 10 boxes, it's probably gonna be more economical for you to go to our partners that are located all over the US to um, be able to easily dispose of your of your documents. Yeah, so you'll see the drop-off locations on shredamerica.com. Shredamerica.com. Thank you. I love you.